Fang Fang, don't do this. Don't come here. Shelly Jun, are you a man? Every day you just indulge in eating, drinking, and gambling. Right now, how dare you spend your daughter to station such days? You can be continually. Fang Fang. Don't do it. Boss, good morning. Housekeeper. Mr. Xiao. You're so stupid. Don't you know what day it is today? Li Jun, it has been 20 years. Besides, set out. Feng Feng, I couldn't afford a piano at that time. Even without a decent dress. I've learned your best loved song today. I played for you. Run fast! Housekeeper, it's a show. Run. You little bastards are crazy. Who arranged you to do this? Legion! Fight with you, Legion! Li Jun! Garbage like you mismatches absolutely my excellence. I will help her find a rich man soon. As for you, where you come, where you go. Fang Fang. Choo Choo. Am I dying? Dreaming? Dad? If I now see you in this way, I will die immediately. 1991? Don't pretend anymore. How many times have you done that? It's wrong. Every time you just swear not to gamble. You change? I tell you. Today, I can take my sister and shoot you away. You carry the force with my sister. Hurry up, sister. Let's go. Fang Fang, choo choo. Dad! Dad! Let's go. Fang Fang! Choo choo! Choo choo! I really have already come back to 1991. Thank God. Gives Scoundrel a chance to make up. Look what? Your courage is stronger? Shelly Jun, you don't like that before. If you're unsatisfied with the work, we can change. Why you do this? How? Are you afraid to suffer from the poor with me? If uh, that, you can go you can find a rich man. Uh, Shelly Jun, your wife is about to give birth. Shelly Jun, Shelly Jun, are you at home? Isn't it natural to give birth? Why are you so fragile? Gotta make dishes! Gotta make dishes! Fang Fang Choo Choo, this time, I must take good care of you. God, thank you so much. Ah, Yanzi, can you let me enter for a while? You, get out! Just a while. You're so nettlesome! Shut up! Shut up! My good brother! Ah, Shelly Joe, don't catch me! It is so nauseous. Ah, uh, Yansen. 1991. I'm back! I'm back. This flourishing age. Dad, you don't be mother. You hit too too. Dad. You don't beat my mother. You hit you too. My mother still needs a work to earn money. Like for you. My mother was too painful to suffer from insomnia in a night. Choo choo. Shelly Jun. Mom, you don't say everything. You will be hit. 
I make dishes. I can't lend money anymore. The factory also refused to advance salary. Dad, Shelly Chun, since I got married with you, I haven't had a good life. My daughter and me are so miserable. Do you know that? Choo Choo, she picked up other popsicles to eat. I promise that you will eat meat right now. Hey, you don't borrow, you rob! Wow, it is meat, it is meat! I know that will bring back meat. That is the best. Fang Fang, can you believe me again? Give me a month. I will let you eat meat every day, even still, you want to puke. Fang Fang, can you believe me again? Give me a month, I will let you eat meat every day, even still, you want to puke. These words you have said many times. Mom, Chicho wants to eat meat. Tara, I'll get it. Pa, I go. Meat? Whose people are eating me? Wow, the life is so good. You even can eat meat, Sister Dan. You still owe me 60 cents. When can you repay, Sister Dan? My life is so terrible. Today we just borrow other money to improve our dishes. When I get salary, I will repay you immediately. I don't believe that. You are so shameless. Buy our money just for eating meat? Don't say everything. Repay the money. I will repay you when I get salary. Beg for you. Can you give me more days? Do you need my brother to provide work with you? Earn money very fast. Look, you are so beautiful like a flower. It is so pity. Shelly Jun, you have time to be the wife, have no time to earn money? Wow. You are a bad woman, but want a good reputation. You can repay the money or earn money. Is your husband reliable? Did he ever care about you? You should cherish your youth. <laughs> you do something bad because they want to get a good reputation? Either you pay back the money or you go and make some money. Is your man reliable? Does he ever take care of you? I'm telling you, while you're still young, you... Shaijun, how dare you hit me? Everyone, let's look over. He has not paying back the money he borrowed and not even beat me up. Shaijun, do you know he's my brother? If you ever pull the Fang Fang again, don't blame me for being brutal. You all hear me? The kid is now at Xiaowei's place. Let me have a drink with you. Hey! Shelly Jun, I may owe you for my past life. I don't ask you to be good to me. But our daughter... Think about our daughter. The tuition fee for her kindergarten. How can you spend it on... Uncle, what else that you can do? Shelly Jun, I've had enough. I've really had enough. You let me die. I can live any longer. Fang Fang, listen to me. I know you've heard me swear that many times. But this time, you must believe me. I don't know how to explain to you what I've been through, but I know. 
I can't afford to lose you, honey. Honey, give me another month and I'll make a hundred thousand dollars. If I don't, they'll kill me again. <laughs> Did you get this plan of work? It's the factory manager. He'll take care of you like it's no big deal. A barefoot man is not afraid of a man in his shoes. Let's go. <laughs> Who are you? Sitting. May I speak to you? What can I do for you? Hey! How did you know? It's a coincidence. I drank quite a lot that day, and I went to pee. Then I happened to see Mr. Ding and the factory girl. Mr. Ding still figures like a youngster. Mr. Ding, keep it up. You... Go ahead. What do you want? Deputy Mayor Lee, this way, please. <laughs> Meet me in my office tonight. We haven't talked about how much yet. <laughs> Deputy Mayor Lee, it's been a long and arduous journey. It's bearable. It's bearable. Lee Su Shang, the Deputy Mayor who died in a landslide that year? His birthday became his death anniversary. Wait, isn't it today? Such a great help from God. Wishing you a happy birthday. Wishing you happiness today, tomorrow, and always. Lee. Comrade, how did you know today is my birthday? I'm sorry for the intrusion, but there's something from my reading. It's just a feudal superstition. <laughs> the beauty Mayor Lee is just a gangster in the village that always beats his wife. And he is very poor. Theater, listen to my advice. If it rains heavily this evening, and lightning strikes the tree at the entrance of the village, do not travel. There will be a cataclysm. Lee Jun, what's your plan? This doesn't work either. Taking me and playing this seems unreliable. We'll see. Two kilometers from Sihuan Mountain in Zomang Village is having mudslide. Hello? Deputy Mayor, the thunderstorm is too heavy. They even split the trees at the entrance of the village, so we can't leave now. If we go back to the village, where would be the car by now? Oh, it should be at Sihuan Mountain. I want to meet them. Lee Jun, do you think the leaders are fool, or are you actually a fool yourself? With just the skills and you still want to scam for money? How about you read Xiaodong's future? Will he be able to marry our sister Yan? Alright, let me do the reading. Read, read what? Hey! Read your fucking ass! See? She's angry. It's him. Come on. What are you doing? What are you doing? Let go of him! Leave her alone! Ah, you bitch! Do you think your men will fight for you? Have you forgotten how he used to beat you? Sister Dan, please let me go. I'll give you the money right away. Do you think you could just pay back the money? It's not that simple. Ah, oh, what a pretty girl. It's a waste to go with them. Brothers, oh, we have some fun tonight, no problem. <sighs> I, Shelly June, have lived a new life. I'll try my best to regain all my lost dignity. I swear I will never let my family be suffered again. You've destroyed the only one in my world. Now destroy your only world. I've been traveled so far all along the darkness. It's not something that you guys will understand. You must remember that what I want is the whole world given to me. You will see. Someone please! There's murder! Up. 
Make sure you remember this. Don't ever bully Fang Fang again, or else I'll settle all old scores with new ones. Leader! Leader! You've got to help us! Shelly just killed my brother! My dear brother, do you have time to talk? You and your brother been causing a lot of troubles at a factory and everywhere else. No, sir. My brother's already in this situation. Shelly Jun, this is the township's leader, Li Shusheng. He's here to thank you. As for both of them, dismissed immediately. They are both fired immediately. Come on. Come on. Stop pulling Fang Fang. Did you hear that? What is that fake? It's not that hard to find out. All it takes is a phone call from the leaders. These guys take the money and the land, move around and commit crimes. They've already scammed a lot of villagers. What? Investing in the winery is scam. So if this project gets started, my class factory is going out of business. Deputy Mayor Lee, you'll also end up in jail if that happens. If it really is a scam, you saved my life a second time. Good brother. Yes, leader. Actually, I'm not helping you for free. I know that. I came here today to talk to you about this. Go pick up your stuff. From today on, you will be my secretary. Leader, I'm not an ambitious man. I just want to make some money and be there for my wife and kids. For making money? Leader, just give me a note. Real steel of this number. Okay, I'll do it. Lee Jun. How do you know all this? Is it really calculated? Calculate? I read it in the paper. Birthdays turn into death dates? How miserable. Yan Zi, this is sweet. You should eat it. I will scream if you keep following me. I've been in love with you for so long. The toad wanted to eat the swan. You? Heh. <laughs> Le Jun. I've been waiting for you. What's up? You were amazing yesterday. You took care of all those hooligans. You're so amazing. What are you trying to say? The man who came with factory director thing yesterday is really the village leader? Uh, hey! You can rest easy for making money. You're in the business. Good brother. My dear brother. I know that you're the most reliable of us. <laughs> Good opportunities are for capable people. Some people can take the chains they can. What? Uh, hey, hey! Save me one! Fang Fang, have Can some fruits. In the past you just hit me. Ignore your family. What about now? You're getting to fight all over the place. Do you know what Yao Dan's brother is like? I asked my brother to take you to back to her grandma's for a while. If Juju is bullied, if something happens to her, I'll get you for that. Shelly Jun, let's get divorced. I can let you hurt Juju. I can't divorce you. I will bring a good love to you and Juju. Cheers. Li Jun. Deputy Mayor Lee was with us before. You and I haven't really had a chance to talk. We men all make mistakes. Legion, please, help me keep my secret. The thing I did is inglorious. The money? I can't take it. Bro, it's not easy for me either. Although my factory is big, it's not so profitable. You have Deputy Mayor Lee on your side. You can't let me die. It's not easy for me to fight for so many years. It was hard. I want to live in peace now.
I see what you mean. I need you to do me a favor. Then you and I are done. Brother, good. You're on the same page. The first time? Well, you get a good night's sleep here. I'm going now. When you wake up tomorrow, just go home. You don't have to do anything. Have a good sleep. Sir. You're a good man. Please help me. I lost my man. My child, my child is ill. I have to make money for my kid. So, you can stay here for two days and wait for me to find someone to pick you up. Then you can work with me later. In addition, I will find a way to pay for your child's medical expenses. Lijun, thank you. My elder sister, my elder sister, good news. Why are you still here? What happened? My brother-in-law now become a factory deputy director. This news has been spread in the village. Why don't you believe me? Let's go and see. Hurry up! In 1991, individual economy will emerge and I need to go into business. In 1994, the rules of futures market won't be perfect, so I need to be bold but cautious and live well enough alone. In 1997, the state sector will retreat and the private sector will advance. On 19th May 1999, the stock market will boom. I need to focus on internet and real estate markets. I'm destined to make great achievements in my life. Fum fum and Juju, both of you will live a better life soon. Sis. What's going on? Do you know how much this is worth? With this note, we have 10,000 yuan. Where did you get that? Fang Fang, as I said, I will definitely give you happiness. Trust me. I do. I believe you. Sure, no. My bro, I trust you. I did something wrong before. Please don't take it. Personally, let's not talk about it as we are a family now. By the way, I'll go out for a long trip in a couple of days. Take good care of your sister. No, my bro, I want to join you. I know, bro, you still bear me a grudge, don't you? Yeah, wait, don't worry. When I come back, let's do something big. Count me in! You all can come. Feng Feng Chuchu, please wait for me. I will make you happy. Yanze. My daughter, wait for me. Honey, where's your boyfriend? He looks very active and energetic recently. I don't know. He says something about note and steel. Honey, you're so lucky. Look at your man. He's like becoming a very different man. Unlike me, I'm all alone. I don't know what happened to him. It all happened so suddenly. Dear, I think Xiao Dong is a good man. He's like a beggar. Me, myself, I'm not like you. I need to find someone irreliable. Having a good relationship with Mr. Ting helps a bit relationship with local leaders if you get rich in the future. Don't forget me. Okay? If you get rich in the future, don't forget me. Okay? Alright, come in the evening. Pick up the goods. Bro, I was right about you. You are awesome. I knew it. He was just being an asshole for a moment. From now on, I will be devotedly follow you. Lijun, if this deal will pay off, I will have the money to treat my kid. I used to be such an asshole, but you still look up to me. Come on, I'll take you 
to make a lot of money. Yes! Yeah. <sighs> Lichun, someone came to steal the steel. Shit, trying to steal my steel? Stop beating! He's dying! Leave the goods. You get out. You bastard! Let's fight! If you choose money over your life... I'll help you then. Get lost. Or die together. Run! Hurry! Cheers! See? See? So much money! This is for Shadong. This is for Lulin. This is for your kid. It's no big deal. Take the money to treat your kid. In the future, I will take you to make more money. Here, this is for your kid too. Don't forget to pay me back. I will never forget your great kindness. Cheers! Ah, cheers! Enjoy! Uh, uh, Jun, how did you foresee that robbery and prepare the weapon ahead? Manager Song is corrupted. But we have to deal with him later. What can we do? Don't worry. Several days later, he will end his day. We don't need the stay in our hands. To us! Cheers! Cheers! No man would marry you. Piss off! You hook up with a widow. Hey, respect. <gasps> Call her. Yanzi. Toast. Go. <laughs> Cheers. Li Jun, you've changed a lot. Now you remind me of the past when we first fell in love. Our parents passed away long ago. It's you that accompanied me. Good day start from now on. Feng Feng, I'll make you happier. You look familiar.
Lijun, who is this old lady? I dreamed of a dream earlier. In my dream, I lost Fang Fang, Chu Chu, and everything. Desperately, I wanted to kill myself. It is this old lady who saved me. She helped me rebuild the confidence to life. A dream? A vivid one that I can hardly tell it from reality. Li Jun, we came so far just to visit this old lady. Her son is a drunker who likes gambling a lot. This is a whistleblower report, but it's bribery and speculation. He's going to undersell his fine coal plan. Shut up, it's time to take all his coal mine. Li Jun, the coal price plunges so much that the moment we start the engine, we lose money. I don't even give it away for free. What's your strategy? He will make money by courage in the 80s and by relationship now. But I, Shelly Jun, make money by my own wisdom. You can take command from me. Yes, sir. Your command is my will. I will do it all my heart. Shelly Jun. Less than a month, he blocked two of my business line. Could it be a coincidence? The investment campaign should be, but the ceased still works. Husband, I miss our daughter. Let's bring Chu Chu back. We'll live together happily. We have to work hard to make money recently. We may not have time for her. When we have enough money, let's leave this place. I'll take you to the big city to enjoy life. Okay, then I will stay with Chu Chu in my brother's home for some days. The contract is signed in the morning, the man is taken in in the afternoon. And do you remember that manager's song, who steal our steel, taken in for corruption? Taken in for corruption? Yes, because of the report, they break into the case. Easily enough to get the piece down, and that Mr. Ding, he can't get away with it. Legion! You are marvelous! In five days, this coal mine will become gold mine! How much? One hundred grand? Shh! Voice down! My good lord! I haven't even seen ten grand! A hundred grand! Yanzi, since I can make money now, how about we... Make money? Is it yours? It belongs to Charlie Shun. Well then, at least I follow the right boss. Give me a chance. You say this, Ya Jun. How can he foresee everything so accurately? I wonder. We come from the same village. Why should he be that clever? Oh, hey, Yanza! Oh, you have quite a few lover boy. You're one of them too. One in your heart, one in your bed. And even a backup option. Be careful not to bite off more than you can chew. Ah, uh, remember last time we almost got caught? Forgot? What's the matter? Can't bear to part with me? Legion, from now on, I'm your adherent. I'll follow you faithfully. Wherever you lead, I won't go the opposite way. If you tell me to catch a dog, I won't chase a chicken. Stop being so talkative. Who'd have thought? The province could build a power plant and still run out of money. They even need to collect our local coal to run it. Hey, bro, how did you know that so accurately? One cannot reveal to find secrets. Ah, if you go time travel, you'd know too. Ooh, if I had known this, I would have bought all the coal mines in our ten villages and each shot. People in this era have no sense of commitment. They're willing to do anything for money. You have the fate of buying a factory. You have the fate to get the money? Yes. They'll definitely come to the tech house. The mine owner you chose just got arrested today. Brother, you're really amazing. Well, this afternoon, take the money, buy some rice, flour, and cooking oil. Let's visit the old lady. Yes! Hey, where are you going, sis? I'm going up the mountain. Li Jun, he met the old lady. Last time in the area, he's busy these days. I'm going to check on the old lady for him. No wonder Xia Li Jun loves you so much. You're so considerate. Go! Good way, Yan. Brother, it seems that you have not figured out what I said. Mr. Ding, what do you mean? You needed money? 
I gave you. You wanted to take that woman I love. You wanted power? Deputy factory director, I made you big. That's right. When you make money, you forgot. I'm feeling a bit disappointed. There is only a small amount of money. I thought it can't even catch your attention. My factory isn't that large in scale. I was thinking, if you have any business, we can do it together. We'll have everything. Money and connections. This is called a win-win situation. Factory tracker team. Do you know how much bad debt the big four banks have right now? 40 billion. Non-performing loans ratio? 60%. In our country, there's only so much money to loan. If you don't make it, and so do I, somebody else makes it. I can't fall asleep. If I don't owe the bank, you just need to work on this project with Lee Sushan. How to arrange? It's up to you. Here. There is little common ground for understanding between persons of different principles. Get Yao Chang over here! Deputy Mayor Lee can't keep granting our request. The coal mill business is not for long. If there's money in the country, the business is out of the question. We have to set up our own factory. Brother, you have an idea! We get together this evening. Let's discuss it in detail. Okay. Ah, help me! What's wrong? Legion, there are rats. Don't be afraid. I'll fetch a stick. Legion, stay with me. I'm really scared. You can feel my heart pounding. Xiang Yan, please respect yourself. I'm a man with a wife and kids. Li Jun, there's no man who doesn't cheat on his wife. You know who's better. Until he's tried. Get up. You're a white elephant, but a man. Yanza. Yanza! Roll out! <sighs> Ding tong wrong. Ding tong wrong. You went to your arms. Right. Ding tong wrong. Sometimes I really envy you for having such a good husband. I also got through the difficult time. Dear Lim. You will find your own happiness. I'm not worthy. Ding Dong Rong. Legion saved me and my baby. You're a mom too. You can't know how I feel. I can't repay you for your kindness. From now on, I will take you as my blood sister-in-law. Take Legion as my biological brother. We're family. Come on, let's go home. This money is far from enough. What can we do, Li Jun? I will go to the camp with Man. Find Li Shusheng. Help! They robbed me of my money! Piss off! Get out of the way! You wanna die? He's an idiot. Let's go. Are you okay? Go home, quick. Hi. Good Kung Fu, it's for you. Just go home, hurry. Hi. What's your name? Lei Feng. That's great, buddy. Our township government will actively encourage your innovation and encourage your business establish. Everyone has a very high level of motivation. There are two large-scale projects under evaluation in your country alone. About factory director thing. All right. I have arranged a meeting to discuss your project. I'll make an inspection in two days. We will go into details. Okay, Deputy Head Lee. 
worked so hard to seduce him. I've tried several times. Now once she sees me, run away from me. What's the name of the guy around him? Dong? Show Dong. Boss, I'm just a country woman. I know nothing. Or I will get the money back. I'm done with this job. Oh, my little girl. What are you back to the country? Holiday. Legion, why don't we have a big opening ceremony? Let the people who use the despise you to look at Legion's power and prestige. Money should be spent wisely. Present, this project is zero progress in China. There is no mature experience from manpower to production. Only at the initial development stage, the money we have at present is not enough. We need to raise money quickly. Tomorrow. The Deputy Headley will have an inspection here. I hope we can get the country loan so that we can ease the pressure. Research and development is done simultaneously. Once you have enough money, you stop production immediately. That, let's have another grand ceremony. Well, I won't expect me shut on. I've also become a senior official of a high-tech enterprise. Brother, follow you and I would have meat to eat. The Deputy Township Chief Lee is on his way. Oh, by the way, my daughter is also in this village. You mean this girl is not obedient at all? When she left, they didn't even say anything to her mother. Come directly with her back. I think this is very similar to this. No sooner said than done. Have a courage and courage. Lay form. Husband, I don't want you to work too hard. Just have enough money to spend. Come on. When I have saved enough money, we're gonna get out of here. I'm taking you to romantic Turkey, then go to Tokyo and pa -ri. I heard that men become bad when they have money. You wouldn't do this, would you? Fofo. There's no point in my life without you. I will always be with you. Forever. Xiao Tong, you really want to be with me? I'm a widow. Yanza, I like you, whether you are a widow or who. I really like you. I like you as a person. Doesn't matter if anything else. Liking is that just lip service. I'll do whatever you want me to do. No need. I just think I don't know you very well yet. You can tell me more about yours. Family, work, or something. It's too late. Go home. It is not, it's not very good for people to see it. I don't care. Go back. Okay. It is you that gave me to him personally. It was you that gave me to him personally. That, that, that's Jelly Joe. You understand? He was a gangster in the village before. He did nothing all day. I'm surprised it's a dark horse. Anyway, when when? Mm. Why do you ask this? He saved me, right? I want to see him <laughs> in person. Well, I'll send the driver to get you there. <laughs> I saw you smile to me then. I decided by heart you are my sole choice this life. <laughs> the factory that you will build next must cost a lot of money. Certainly. We are counting on the investment from the country. <laughs> We get considerable dominant products of innovation. I think we'll make it. Then, did the deputy mayor Lee agree to invest in your program? For the relationship between Legion and deputy mayor Lee? Not 100%. There may be a possibility of 90%, but that depends on Mr. Ding's program. The country faces a financial strain. Though Mr. Ding locates the factory in the village, it has a strong strength. 
There are also manufacturers nationwide. What's your next move? Well, I hand the project proposal to the country up for assessment. Legion and I spent a couple of days formulating it. Didn't I do well? What plan? I've never seen it. Show me. I can know how strong you are. No way! Legion said it is a business secret. Outsiders can't read it. I'm a rural woman. Why are you so protective? In the end, you're making a stranger of me. No. Happiness is that sudden. I can't believe it temporarily. <laughs> Arrange the plan I gave you as soon as possible. I want to see their project proposal. Zhang Yun's side has already taken action. Li Shu Shang. Shali Ju, if I don't strangle your scheme in the cradle, the days ahead, it won't be easy. Happy, Happy birthday! birthday. Hey, Sister Yan. Life has improved. And my bowl of lunch feeding noodles seems modest. What are you talking about? Back when times were tough, every birthday, it was Sister Yan who prepared lunch feeding noodles for me. Come join us for a meal. I'm an outsider, so I won't intrude. Young sister, happy birthday. You, go ahead. I will leave now. Come on. You're not an outsider. I want to discuss something with everyone. I want to discuss something with everyone. I love Seung Yun. I want to marry her. Xiao Tong, have you made your mind? Yes, I have. I will marry her indeed. Xiao Tong, I support you. Chang Yang didn't live a good life, but she is a good person. I bless you. Xiao Tong, I respect your courage. I believe you two will live happy together. Really? Thanks for your good wish. Did you hear them, Yanzhe? They all support us. Normally, I didn't drink wine. But today is my birthday, and a good day for Xiao Tong and Yan Chu. Yan Chu, take out your good wine. I will drink them up. Huh? I will fetch it. Oh my! Oh. What's wrong? Oh. Happiness comes all of a sudden! Uh. <laughs> this is my first time! Oh. What are you crying for? I have no memory for all this! <laughs> mm. Mr. Ding, what do you mean, Mayor? I'll get it straight. You prove me the loan, 30% goes into your pocket. Ding dong wrong! What a dirty business! Now I see into you. Li Shushan, you'll retire within a few years. Just turn a blind eye to it. Take the money. Live in comfort and peace with your family. Isn't it good? I, Li Shushan, am impartial. Bye! Playful. You're a girl. Why are you here? I'm coming for you. Don't thank me. Your father and I claim to be acquaintances. Piece of cake. I'll go. Shelly Jun, I like you. Are you kidding me? You do know I'm married, right? It doesn't matter. More importantly, do you share the same feeling with me? No. Don't come to me anymore. Help! 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 
I thought you said you didn't like me. You care about me, right? Though I have experienced another nine days, when I travel across again, I'm still shocked by the opportunities to get rich in the 1990s. I just apply the business practices that are common in 2010 to the present. Then I have earned a decent income. My family is harmonious now. I'm moving towards my higher goals. Tachu, I shut it out. Now our business in the village is very profitable, as we're the first to make fruity meats. Business is very, very good. People queue up for it every day. People not only recognize us. After opening the franchise, it quickly occupied our local market, and it can become a scale soon. It is impossible for the competitors to keep up. We have won the market after using the membership value card instead of losing money, has made a lot of money than before. Customers are willing to come to us. In our account, there is at least 400,000 working capital. It is enough to lend a factory. Brother, what about opening up a few more big markets? In this case, we can earn money from this project for a lifetime. It feels particularly unreal. Do you still think it is like a dream? Especially Lillian and Xiao Tong. It's really been more than 10 days and they seem like they have been businessmen for years. Sister, it's because the region is so prophetic and insightful on business. Xiao Tong and I can compare to him. Sister, when you studied from Li Jun, you progressed so fast. But for Lillian and I, we took a lot of time. <laughs> you protect me so well. But now we need at least 3 million more. And don't worry, looking back, you had nothing. But now, you have at least one million, right? And it only took you for a very short time. The fund allocated by the village, plus the loan from the bank, it won't be a big issue. I will go on a business trip tomorrow. Where? Shenzhen. Go to Jiawei's home and company Chu Chu when it's still not dark. Hey, 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 who's there? Ah. What are you doing? It's you again. They robbed me. You followed me for a whole afternoon, right? I heard that you are going on a business trip. Here's a box of food I made for you. The thief took your box? Shen Li Jun, this is the first time I cook for others. Don't be a jerk. I have made myself clear. Don't waste your time. How do you know I'm going on a business trip? My dad's assistant told me. Let's go. Where? I will send you home. Shen Li Jun, I knew it. You still care about me, right? You still care about me. Get your hands off me. Yanzhe, I can't believe that in my life I can see you worry about me. I'm willing to die, let alone get beaten up. I will go and make a meal. Yanzhe, I want to take care of you for the rest of my life. I will call you when the meal is ready. Legion! It's Legion! Is our fun issue solved with him being on TV? I will introduce you to start a business store in our village. Mr. Shelly Jun. Did you forget your task? Yanze, have some sunflower seeds. 
Li Jun, you must have a good drink today. Technical issue is solved. Our project was widely promoted on TV. There must be no issue for getting the fun from the village. Also, this time we should really appreciate Deputy Mayor Lee. Without his recommendation that brought us such a big promotion, our investment this time wouldn't have too much chance. That's right, our time is coming. Let's get drunk. Cheers! For our future. Let's get drunk. Lee Jun's wife is not back yet. You two, don't drink too much. Uh, it is because that his wife is not back yet that we can drink a lot. Lee Jun, it must be great luck that I can work with you. <laughs> Here, Yansa. Cheers. Cheers. Without his recommendation that brought us such a big promotion. If you dare to tell Shodong the truth, I will kill you both. If you dare to tell Shodong the truth, I will kill you both. Boss, can I return the money to you? I can't finish this tax. You have quite a lot of lovers. I mean you one of them. Be careful and don't get caught. Did you forget your task? Why did you drink so much? The door was not even locked when I came back. I was happy. Right. I saw you on TV yesterday. It's like a dream. Fang Fang. I was a jerk before. I promise, I will make you much happier in the future. Vision, the PD Mayor Lee asks you to go to the village. Maybe he got the result of the fun. Let me die. Let me die. How can you be such a fool? Xiaodong, I don't want to cause trouble to you anymore. Could you just let me die? Xiaodong. You can't protect me. Take me away. Could you take me away? Let's go as far as we can. Your best friend slept with your women. I'm helping you. If you choose the right side, you can get an amount of money. Your whole family and Zhong Yan can live peacefully. But if you choose wrong, choose by yourself. It's several people's destiny. You need to decide. <laughs> Think about it. I will take you away after I get the money. Li Shusheng asked Shelly Jun to go to the village. Ah, it's too late. Is there thing? Do you want to kill them? Shelly Jun is a rare talent business. What a pity. 
that Li Shusheng blocks in the way for me to make money. I am afraid it's still not enough to kill them both. Li Jun, you have to develop the industry into a big scale so that you can make the people of the village rich. Don't worry, Deputy Mayor Li. I will keep my promise. I am always wondering why I encountered quite a lot of capable businessmen before. But I never met someone like you who is profiting. We're in advanced business mode. I checked your background. Your changes really surprised me. <laughs> it's okay if you don't want to tell me. But you need to be careful of the bank. If it is too obvious, some people must suspect that you bribed me, and they won't listen however we explain. Soon, I will retire. It's better to be careful. Deputy Mayor Lee, I won't let you down. I am relieved with your words. Uh, you must take your family to my house. After a few days, the president of the bank will be there too. Sure. <laughs> What are you doing? I am here to tell you what you need to do next. After I finish this task, give me the money and let us go. As long as you work with us. Shadong. Shadong. Why did he come to you? Li Jun, seeing me with Dong Chu, he used to harass me. He threatens Dong Chu. Whatever happens in the future, just tell me. Don't suffer alone. Yeah. Sister Yan, let's go home first. Dong Chu, let them talk. Okay. Dongzhu, it is really a critical moment for our factory recently. During this period of time, you need to be much more careful. Uh, religion, it's my fault. I spend too much time on dating. Come, let's go to the office. Discuss the next time. Brother, if anyone hurts his in law what will you do? What happened? Will you throw caution to the wind? What happened? Would you do anything to save her? Oh, sure. We still lack lots of money. What about going to the bank to borrow some? We need to go there ahead to ask for money beforehand. Go to Deputy Mayor Lee's home and meet the Governor of Bank. I'll hook this up. Yes, these days in the market, I can see some thugs hanging around. Mr. Ding is anxious. We have to hurry. We only take some local specialty. Is it enough? Deputy Mayor Lee is upright. He won't accept expensive things. To run the factory well, for him, is the best gift. The countryside is wonderful, with buildings and cars here. Fang Fang, wait for me. When the factory gets back on track, we'll live in big city. I don't care where we live. I just want you and choose you by my side. Please help Sir Lishu. He was taken by the police. When, when? Why are you so worried? Dad, he saved my life before. Where you often speak highly of him. He's an excellent businessman. If you help me now, he must be grateful to you. That's right. I'll give it a shot.
Don't worry, sister-in-law. Legion goes to cooperate with police. He'll be back soon. I'm so scared. The beauty Mayor Lee was dead in front of us. And now Shell Lee was taken by the police. I feel so... What's wrong? Is Shell Legion arrested? It's supposed to investigate the case of Deputy Mayor Lee. However, the police won't investigate illegal fundraising case as well. The illegal funding raising? Those thugs in the market. I'm afraid that he is hard to set free. What should we do? Don't worry, sister-in-law. We are by your side. Now our business is legitimate. He will be free after the investigation. Well, Lulin and I are busy. You must take good care of yourself. Lulin and I are busy. You must take good care of yourself. There is more to it. What should we do? What should we do? Deputy Mayor Lee's case probably has a great influence on the investment and the force that happened in the market. The bank loan is hard to get recently, since Legion isn't here. Do you have any solution? And the illegal funding raising case, it will take lots of time. Don't know when he will be released. We must hold on. Money is the most urgent issue. The factory needs at least 300,000 yuan to run normally. That's too much. We have no idea to get so much money. So we should borrow money from loan shop. No way. It's too risky. The factory should sit down first. We'll talk about this after Legion releases. People on Mr. Ding's side have got Legion's project plan. If we slow down our step, they will take full advantage of Project plan? How did they got it? Everyone involved with the plan in the village, do you think they are all clean? That's why we have to act fast. Hey, Sister Ian. Where are you going with all those bags? Oh, I... I have an urgent matter at my parents' home. I need to go back there quickly. Initially, it was unintentional for me as well to establish a relationship with Deputy Township Chief Lee. I told him that the investment promotion he was leading was a scam, but since then, we have already provoked Director Ding. Based on the information I have, this group is involved with Director Ding including our drinking session later on. His enthusiasm for loans for the village also confirmed my suspicions. I didn't expect that Director Ting's social background is so complicated, intricate, and intertwined. For enterprises of the size of Director Ting's factory, the political and business relationships behind them are usually quite complex. The second time we targeted his interest was with the steel mill. Although Deputy Township Chief Lee approved it for us, it's difficult to transport the steel out. Last time, we risked our lives, and the quantity was small after all. It's very likely that Director Ding let us go at a time, but he never expected that we would stand against him and become his opponents. He must be regretting it now for not having eliminated me in the early stages. The membership cards, the illegal fundraising, they're definitely his minions doing. They have been monitoring us all along, secretly contacting those members who made deposits, giving them money, and accusing us of illegal fundraising. Deputy Township Chief Lee is an upright person. He wouldn't compromise his principles. He has a completely different style from the previous leaderships. That's why he brought calamity upon himself. We should also be on Director Ding's list. But for some reason, he still hesitates and hasn't taken action yet. Maybe they still think we're not capable enough. Even your recent imprisonment. It might be just to scare us. To make us back down. Our plan book was just submitted to the township. And it can go directly to Director Ding's hands. You see, it seems that the township is rotten to the core. From now on, we must be cautious in our actions. We can't avoid dealing with Director Ding. And besides, our foundation is weak. We can't confront him. Head on. If there's anything, we must discuss it in advance. For such a long time. It's the first time I have a bad feeling. Don't worry, Brother Jun. Lulin and I will keep an eye on things. Go back and spend time with your wife. Alright. 
Thank you for your hard work. I'll go back and find Fang Fang first, then we can talk about work. Ah. Uh, aren't you living with me? Oh, uh, well, Yan told me she wants to visit her hometown, so I'll take her to the township this afternoon. I'll come find you immediately after I return. Quit the hurry and work hard. Watch I settle these matters. We'll have a wedding celebration for you. Okay. Li Jun, what exactly happened? How did our good days turn out like this? Fafang. <sighs> Li Jun, it feels like I'm in a dream. You used to always hit and scold me, but now when I'm being bullied, you actually came in front of me and knocked down the people who bullied me. In the past, I was the one supporting the family alone, but now I don't even need to go to factory. The money you earn is enough for me to spend a lifetime, but I always feel like You've become a different person. You're still you, but I can't help but feel like, but feel that something has changed. What exactly happened to you? Fang Fang, I have experienced some unexpected events. I may not be able to explain it to you for now. They say a wife is a companion. That discussing ten things that led to success and not. Although I'm just a rural woman, I can share the burden for you, but. No matter what happens to you, you should let me know. Li Jun, it's not easy for you to handle such a big mess alone. Do you remember the afternoon you took Juju to your parents' house? That day, in the kitchen, I saw my one barrel. It was filled with gasoline. At that time, I was going through such a difficult time. I feel like I couldn't support you too. That afternoon, I... That afternoon, in the past though you made promise and swore oath, I could still see deceit in your eyes. That afternoon, it was completely different. I had a dream. That afternoon, you set the house on fire. At that time, I was such a pastor, I didn't even have the courage to commit suicide. So I wandered aimlessly and ended up in the mountains. On the mountain, I met auntie. She always brought incense to the temple on the mountain. I accompanied her, and together we delivered it to the temple every day. I took care of auntie for a long time. Later, auntie's son got into trouble, so auntie headed over a steel mill to me to manage. This dream and reality are strangely similar. In that dream, I make my first bucket of money through the steel mill. So I go south to the business. I open a company, make a lot of money, and live a good life. But Fang Fang, you and Juju are not with me. I live with the pain of regret every day. I sometimes think about starting a new life. But I can't forget you. It's not just guilt. It's love. After I lose you, I realize how much I love you. In my dream, Shodong introduced me to all kinds of women. But none of them could replace you. Li Jun, it's good that you had such a dream, which prevents both of our lives from regrets. I must say thanks to that dream. Living with the pain of longing for the rest of my life, I can't bear it. Li Jun, we'll have better days ahead about the business. You have Liu Lin and Xiao Tong. They are growing up very fast and are both devoted to you. That's why I think we'll get through this at last. Xiao Dong. What happened to Xiao Dong? In my dream, Xiao Dong betrayed me. When I went to visit your grave, he set me up with some of the company's shareholders. So I woke up from my dream. Xiao Dong is the most trustworthy. What happened in the dream can be trusted. Do you remember where this is? Yes. This is the group we used to come to. On the dates, the first time we held hands, the first time we kissed. It was all here. I've been having a lot of trouble lately. Let's go for a walk. You were so naughty back then. Once on a date, a steel truck came by us. You nudged me forward, scaring the driver. It seems Mr. Tang had penetrated the steel mill at that time. I see. 
Well, it really affected his benefits. What? <laughs> Nothing. Let's take a walk. Four hundred thousand yuan, one hundred thousand yuan of it directly to me. I've given you the money. It's up to you how to divide it. Have you brought all the things I want? Tongchu, as you have had the money, go with me now. I've got some unfinished business to take care of. You go first. I'm scared. Yenza, I'll find you. Trust me. I can't live until I'm sure you're safe. You must be safe. Wait for me. No matter what happens, even if I have to betray the whole world, I will stand in front of you and protect you. Yanza, what do you like about me? At first, I wanted to marry a powerful man, but the poor woman like me, being a widow, didn't know anyone powerful. Then I wanted a rich man, but the rich also looked down on me. They're the man you can count on. But some men who look dependable are very critical of my identity of a widow, thinking I'm not good enough for a post. At first, I thought you were the most unreliable one. No money. No power, the only advantage is honesty. But I didn't expect that you are the manliest one. You don't mind that I'm a widow, and you don't care what people say about you. You are the real man. So, I'm the last alternative? Then, dare you not to be my alternative? Come here, let me kiss you. Help! There's a rogue! I love Xiangyang. I want to marry her. Yanzhe, I love you. Whether you're a widow or not, I really love you. I never thought that in my lifetime I'd ever see you worrying about me. It's worth dying for, let alone getting a beating. I don't remember anything. <laughs> Yanzhe, 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 there's a sweet. Have a try. Yanzhe, Yanzhe. And Zeh, do you hear that? They all agree with us. Shut up! Are you insane? Do you know what it means? It means our effort was fucking in vain. It means you give the company to others with your own hands. Shelly Jun, Shou don't need that to save the company. Well, Shelly Jun, is money the most important in your eyes? More important than your homies? Do you really treat me as your homies? Do you? If I don't treat you as my homies, I will not brought you this far. You did? You slapped it with my wife! Xiao Dong. Pardon? The day coming back from Shenzhen. We were drunk. This bro. He slapped it with my wife! Feng Feng. What? Isn't Shelly Jun bankrupt? Die Shelly Jun's wife for me! Shelly Jun... Love, you've changed. I'm such an idiot, so foolish. Feng Feng, the whole thing goes wrong. 
I know what I'm saying. You won't believe me. But I swear, I was set up. Truly. You're gonna hurt me anyway. Why give me hope? Where are you going? To my brother's home? Let me calm down for a while. Come here. Answer me. What the hell is going on between you and Shelly Jun? You snoop in my diary. I've introduced you to so many guys. You can't even see one. You fall in love with a married hooligan. You... You bring shame on me. You flirt with all the ladies every day. Why can't I love a married girl? <sighs> Tomorrow... Go back to the city soon. No way. I'm surely what shall lead you. Let her go. Do not come back here forever. Shelly Jun. Shelly Jun. Shelly Jun. Please hold me tight. Shelly Jun. Now I just want to know. Do you have feelings for me? Don't waste your time on me. Shelly Jun, I'm too good to you, and you go too far. From now on, I won't waste time on you. Bye. Cry wolf. I didn't expect his wife so young. We cut a great deal. <laughs> What's wrong? Who did this? The lone shark won a gang, Shelly Jun's wife. The screws on him to return the money. But they got the wrong person. They didn't know when when. They got the wrong person. They didn't know when when. Kill him. Kill him! I will kill him! I'm not your chum. I have no patience. You son of a bitch! I'm gonna kill you! You can have a try. I'll get them times paid on your beloved Zhang Yun. Please. Please let Zhang Yun go. You can do whatever you want to me. Please. Please let Zhang Yun go. Please. Take it easy. You will soon meet your beloved Zhang Yun. Things are out of control. Just take them out of here. To Shenzhen. I've arranged it all. The car is waiting outside the village. Try not to alarm anyone. Brother-in-law, what's going on? What well, the coming good time is gone. Let me handle this urgent thing first. Then I'll meet you guys to explain what's going on. Dad. Hurry up. Bring nothing but money. Fang Fang. I didn't betray you. Shelly Jun, run away with your families. Just don't struggle. Yo Chang, I can't figure out that you are really a good slave. What did you say? I say you were a good slave. If you aren't clear, I can engrave it on your monument. Let's fight! Shelly Jun. 
child, child. Vision. Then. Vision. Vision. Sister, child matters. Just go. Go. Sister, hurry up! Sister, go quickly! Sister! Fang No! Shelly Jun, what a surprise that you and I have made it this far. You and I are absolutely different people. At the beginning, you prevent me making money. Mr. Ding. Your illegal business won't last for a long time. The result is blame on you. That's not important. Shelly Jun, you... You ruined Wen Wen's life! How dare you! How dare you! There you are! How, how awful! It's just an accident. We were all involved. If you hadn't pushed so hard to let Sharong fall into your net, when, when, won't shut up! This whole thing is your fault. None of their business. Let him go. Just kill me. <laughs> I'm gonna let you all die. I'm gonna let you all die. Take them to hell one by one in front of your eyes. Your loved wife. Your brother. <laughs> Shut up. Not only tell me all the company's secrets, but also help me. You're an idiot. And that fucking bitch? She never slept with Shelly June. Everything was our arrangement. <laughs> what? What do you mean? You betrayed your brother. Got four people killed. Because of a woman. How admirable. If I had no choice. If I disobey your chin, he would kill you. Good.
great. I am very satisfied. The pain you've suffered is nothing compared to that of mine. Li Jun! Li Jun! Li Jun! I'm gonna let you know what is real pain. Don't! 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 Li Jun! In my next life, I still want to be your wife. Legion, I'm sorry. Don't you? I love you. Don't you? I love you. Fang Fang! Shirley June, ever since I married you, I've never had a good day. That's enough. I've had enough. Shirley June! Let me die! Shirley June! You should get a divorce. I can't let you drop Choo Choo into this. It's all my fault. It's all my fault. Did you? Don't say that. For a while now, I've been very content and satisfied. It was Ding Wen Wen who saved us. Did she also call the police? It was Liu Lin. The explosives were about to go off. Ding Dong Rong was going to die with us. But then, Ding Wen Wen rushed into the explosives, standing in front of us. Ding Dong Rong must have been concerned about his daughter, so he extinguished the explosives. In fact, it all began with a misunderstanding. The users wanted to kidnap Liu Yangfang, who threatened me. But by accident, Ding Wen Wen was with me then. The users grabbed the wrong person. Thus, she was involved in this disaster. When Ding Dong Rong knew that Ding Wen Wen had been raped, he lost his mind and then abducted us. Later, Lilin found Ding Wen Wen. I guess he told her what happened. For fear that her father would make another mistake, she decided to come with Lilin to save us. I haven't seen you for a long time. You must be busy lately. Lee Chun, seems like everything is going as you planned. Ting Wen Wen is also part of your plan? No. She was an accident. What's your next move? To get out of here, to Shenzhen. <laughs>